guys, hear me. <laughs> Welcome back to Beyond the Pine, episode five, something. 145. Big. Hey, oh, guys, guess not. what? Somebody come get, get her. her. She's dancing Let's like dancing a stripper. Like a stripper. Somebody, Somebody come tip, tip her. her. She's dancing like a stripper. A, I hope we don't get copyright a, claimed because that sound is so fucking good. Seriously, because this episode <laughs> makes a million dollars. I fucking love TikTok. <laughs> <laughs> All right, Steve. Sweet, sweet news. Green that Steve. Guys, that's what they call him. Green beans. Steve. Green, <laughs> green tinge Steve. Yup, been eating too many veggies. <laughs> <laughs> oh man, Steve's been no, eating too hasn't. much, uh, too many vitamins, so that it makes his pea green. But it's so many vitamins that it's making his skin green. Oh, let's get peas. Poo poo, you. I smell you from here. Stinky Ooh. Steve, that's what they call Stuck me. Stuck into my own <laughs> ass. Nobody, nobody fucking calls me that. <laughs> uh, yes, they did, though. No, nobody cool. fucking calls me that, dude. This is or episode 145. What, this is episode 145, the special Halloween episode, baby. What's up, guys? Look, Merry guys, Halloween. I got Michael, Michael Jordan on my shirt. MJ, slam dunk. <laughs> MJ? <laughs> Michael Jordan, MD. <laughs> <laughs> oh, my God. Dude. Is that Michael Jordan, the slasher? <laughs> is that Michael Jordan dressed up as fucking Michael Jackson? <laughs> <laughs> oh man, you take off three oh. masks and it's uh, Michael. Dude, Michael Corleone. James got that Herbal Monte. Well, we just mm -hmm. want to say we're in such a great mood today, you guys. We're so happy and having fun. It's a great day. It's excited outside. And James it's is excited drinking, outside. Uh, <laughs> oh, it's because you've been going Monte. on walks, right? Probably. That probably makes you mood better. Dude. Right? Yes, it definitely does. And I don't go on walks, man. I go on fucking nature. Mountain hikes, bro. Totally. Sammy Joe and I sure, went out to, yeah. listen to this. Probably. Hey, you don't have to bring Sammy Joe into this, man. Have you ever been to, um, <laughs> actually, you probably haven't. There's this place that used to be a Nazi sympathizer, um, like, thing. Compound? <laughs> compound. Yeah, compound. And it was oh, like, okay. it was like shut down and it's like part of this like hiking trail now. It's all just like graffitied out like crazy and it's abandoned. But it, like scales to get there, it was all shut down, but we were just going on this hike and we had read about it before we were going to this place. And you can walk down like, 500 steps and they're really shitty and sketchy and then there's this like slab of fucking concrete with this door with like barbed wire and like, like a bunker combined like a bunker with well the, this does well, you're not is it the, a you're not at the bunker yet this is on the way to it it's like a long hiking trail like adventure that like a lot of people hike at to go just like check it out and shit but um it was closed was it? A, it's a <laughs> Nazi place. It, it was the best a Nazi ending, dude. Because you like fumbled and like da, 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 like you went through that whole story. Was so excited, and then and then it was closed. <laughs> was it? You're saying it was a Nazi place, though. It used to be a Nazi was sympathizer this in, compound. Is this when you in went California? To, and now this is it's when like you were in a, Germany. A historic location on a hike that you can see. Um, yeah, I forget what it's called. Murphy's Ranch yeah. compound, I think. I don't know. I, I don't Murphy's know. Ranch. For a guy with a bad memory, somehow I remembered a Nazi sympathizer compound name. Uh, Murphy's Ranch. Hey, yeah, it's controversial, yeah. dude. Murphy That's Ranch. Abandoned Nazi camp in Santa Monica. Yeah. Wow. How about that? Oh, it was in Santa Monica. I didn't realize we were even there. Or like well, it had to Santa, be Santa Monica, Monica but it's Palisades. Santa Monica Mountains. Yeah. It was Palisades. Exactly. Pal Palisades. Yo, Palisades is my goal of dude, where I want to live. Dude, same. I know. Mm -hmm. 100%. I want to get a nice little plot and build an epic house. Dude, just how, how do you guys we, both have the same house goals? Are you guys fucking, like talking to each other? Yes. How do we get Yeah, me and Kim I always talk to each other, okay? If yeah. you guys keep watching, don't hit that so don't hit that subscribe button. <laughs> don't hit your grandmother. She phone can't get up. Lava alert. Lava alert. Lava alert. <laughs> Lava alert. <laughs> Lava alert. <laughs> Dude, Amber, Amber seriously, Amber tangents. keeps getting into trouble. I can't get her, I can't get her out. Oh, yeah, no. seriously. Yeah. That's, Who's that? That's emergency after emergency with this Thanks, Amber girl. Dude. Yeah. What, what makes uh, that funny to you, Steve? Because yeah. of uh, the implications of it. Wow, the implications of the seriousness of the nature of what that means? Yikes, bro. You're fucking canceled. Is that implications thing from Sonny? When he, the, the boat thing? Or was it, was it a different wor word? word? Because of the implication? implications? Was used in a different no, context. I think that they definitely yeah, did, but it was... Way. No, they said it about implications about um Jane, him, Dennis. Oh, him no, him Dennis. Yeah, someone, Dennis. Yeah. Like uh, because of the manipulating women. Yeah, you wouldn't yeah. do that. You wouldn't because of the implications. Dude, James is finally watching Always Sunny All of in it. Succession. I love it so you just started much. watching. It's the best show. Well, no, it's I've that seen, and fucking The Office. Yeah, no, absolutely. This is the first time I've seen past like season four. Because you'll I remember, notice like, so much of the last... inspiration of SB Seven. Yeah. Sort of. Well, not everybody. Just well, mostly you. Mostly Steve. 
<laughs> Mostly Kib. Yeah. <laughs> get fucking wrecked, Kib. No, Kib, dude. Get fucking, get fucking wrecked, wrecked, idiot. Man. I said that Whoa, for you, looks bro. like you need some B12. <laughs> dude, oh, you Kib. need some B's. <laughs> <laughs> looks like you need yeah. some immune vitamins. I already had mine. I actually have vitamins that have fucking... Uh, what's it called? Nootropics in it too. So I'm getting fucked. You are. Don't change the subject. Show me the other thing. What? I have anti gravity pills. The other thing, <laughs> nootropics. Um. Anyways, dude, it's always sunny. I'm so proud of you. It's so good. It. It's dude, so fucking good. The fucking quarantine episode. Don't remember it. It's where they were in the bathroom and they all when thought they were sick. And they're all sick. And Dennis and is like, uh, uh, "What is someone that's sick? Can someone that's sick do this?" It's great that his mic's cutting out while he's doing this. Dude. Was it? <laughs> it's like <laughs> <laughs> that exactly. Well, I'm just, I'm dude. Like, I'm, I'm hitting those frequencies. You know what I mean? Dude, I remember back in the day, Steve. Eight hundred thousand like, hertz. Whoa, we're kind of like a, the millennial uh, uh, thing, and we would be like, James is kind of like Dennis. Uh, I forget. No, I'm kind of like Mac, were. dude. Yeah, no, Steve was Dennis. You were Mac, and I was Charlie. I remember we would say yeah. that, Steve. Steve, don't act like you don't have inspiration. Yeah, no, no, but bro, I'm just trying to shit. Dog. I'm trying you to think of if James would have even recognized what that meant at the time. So no, no, you and I, I know would say I, that, Steve. Not me and James. No, I and you, I had watched. I think you would say that. We I think together, I would say that you're like Charlie. We had I think together we had all that said that, bro. and I had seen some of the show up until that point to understand, but I haven't. I didn't watch it like in succession the entire show like I'm doing now. And I also don't have inspiration, dude. Yeah, no, everything Steve comes up is just entirely original. He doesn't have I try to make it it's original for the most part, to Everyone be honest. tries to make everything original, dude. It's so easy, like, but I don't, I have sub, okay, I'll, I'll give you this. I have subconscious mm -hmm. inspiration, but I don't purposely get inspired to, to do my own version of, of some type of comedy, you know? Like, I don't see a, a comedian think, and then. Yeah, no, I mean, it's not like that. It's just like, you like that style of humor, so you naturally do yeah. the similar It'll type naturally of humor. come up. That's, what, that's still inspiration. Yeah. It's, it's subconscious, technically, yeah, but, like, that's most of everyone's, dude. Like, same. Mm, like, I guess I, not everyone, not everyone, though. Right. <laughs> well, wait, where, where, who's on, who are you looking at on that? Because I don't know your screen, man. Dude, you're trying to gaslight me now, too? What the fuck? I'm looking at whoever's over there. Yo, if we're going to get my into perspective, virtue signaling. No <laughs> virtue signaling. <laughs> Dude, What's virtue classy. signaling? Yeah, I don't know. I uh, it's like happened. where you tr call yeah. birds or something. I don't know. <laughs> virtue um, signaling, dude. <laughs> dude how are you liking you? it, bro? Go ahead. How am I liking what? I was asking James how he's liking. It's always sunny. I love oh, it so already, much. He it's loves brilliant. It. It's, I, know. It. I know. How far in are you? It's fantastic. It. It's truly like it. so good. Yeah, true. Um, it's funny though. Like they become so self-aware of how long they've been on the air like in mm. later seasons and they did one episode that was about like recycling or something. And it literally was like all a metaphor for recycling old storylines and old jokes. Like so many shows that run for like eight plus seasons end up just recycling the same shit. Mm -hmm. And so they made like a self-aware meta episode about that. And it was so good. Yeah. They're hey, dude. It doesn't bother you guy or it doesn't bother you Kib that I I'm telling you to eat. And no, I think it's so funny, before. dude. I thought it was funny. amazing. Yeah, you know Funny I'm like serious. Answer. I'm serious though, right? I think you're semi. I think you're like you it's guys like, should it's, do that. It's like, a but you know seriousness. it's, but you know it's funny to remind your friends to eat, but Dude. also beneficial. And I think that's I've been sweet trying to make. Funny. I've been trying to to mother you and Nick to Nick make us feel be, better. Dude, Nick needs to be mothered right now. Mm. Nick needs to be mothered. He needs help. Yeah. Not help, but he's like he needs help to a good schedule. He's on the worst sleep schedule. I feel so bad for him, and he's not eating. He's he's lighter than he's ever been in his life. Mm. So I'm trying mm. to get him to eat. I'm trying to yeah, cook him up dinner. Since he was three years it old, it sucks when you get caught up in like a, a routine like that. That's really bad for you, bad on your health and your sleep and stuff. But it's working in other aspects. Like he's actually creating things. Mm -hmm. So t he's subconsciously associating these really bad habits with like a good outcome, and it's yeah. just that's gonna be tough. Well, he knows it's that. bad because the whole reason he was able to stick to a normal sleep schedule, which is like probably 80% of like how you fucking just feel yeah. good again. And then eating is probably the rest. But like he doesn't have sessions at 2 p.m. every day now. Oh. He doesn't have mm. any booked sessions, so he can do whatever the fuck yeah, he wants like, for how could he? however long he wants. He also uh, he was saying this the other day that he won't feel accomplished. So then he cannot if he doesn't accomplish something enough to feel accomplished he c literally cannot sleep and has insomnia so he just doesn't sleep until he's done enough and that could be two days two and a half days that's crazy man yeah that, but like i do I, it's a burden, yo i you know? i uh respect and admire that level of dedication because i haven't 
unlocked that self-motivation in me and that willpower in myself yet to be like that where it's like i have to finish this you know what i mean uh-huh. and so not, I hope not even I finishing just like feeling like you did enough yeah feeling that you deserve general, yeah. to like your day is now done you know what i mean yeah it's a Which tough thing like, to get past yeah because i feel like you can wait why how, how do you know what <laughs> what <laughs> dude, wait. dude this is nick right next to me that's how much i worked better than him Wow, you were a fucking Dude, this freak, is, man. That this is, is so Nick's true. work ethic, Still are, but and this is this is my work ethic. In the thick of it, supporting my friends. Sorry, Nick. Oh, Schmiz, Schmiz, and Billy and fucking Aaron. Oh, boom, 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 a boom. Somebody come get her. She's dancing, dancing like, like a stripper. I'm just gonna do that every time I don't have anything to add that's to what great. I'm saying. That's great. That's great. That's great. That's a good. That's a good transition. Because now look, we're all smiling. It's like, and now we're all smiles, it's like, who gives a shit now, dog? Oh, my know? God. What? Boys, I have to be quiet for this, but I have more. Uh, yeah! More, more, my favorite more part of the day. Drama. I have more fun house Let's news. Let's go. This one's about a man that lives across the hall from me. More fun house Sh- news? Doogie Allen. Yes. Uh, once Stogie. Again, it, is, it is a Hoodie Allen story now. Very recently, he's been... Um, playing a lot of poker so he's been very distracted all day pokemon long time dude and he's been uh ch- i guess not chewing his food oh yeah 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 yeah, yeah, yeah i guess yeah. he hasn't been chewing i guess that's part of it now recently he's swallowed a piece of food and it's, it took a turn for the worse he uh didn't exactly choke but there was something stuck and i'm talking st yuck he S-T-W-Y-U-K. was he double yuck he was yeah fucked up dude he was vomiting all over he was vomiting in his room. Littlefoot was eating it up and then spitting it in Man. my mouth. Uh, you got Hoodie going in the bathroom, puking for 20 minutes. Poor guy. I felt so bad for him. We go to the hospital. And they say, you know what they say to him? You don't chew so fast. And you know what? He's become, I'm not going to. Is he I was better gonna now? Say, I was gonna, not in terms of his mobility. I mean, oh, I see. That's what, more what I was asking. It's, yeah. it's the poker, dude. It's the poker. Him, Cause, cause you, okay, <gasps> him and Nick have too many vices right now, and I need to save them, and I don't know how to save them. I feel like Jennifer Lawrence hey, from Mother hey, right now. Hey, it's not your responsibility. Right. But it makes me men. feel better to make them feel better. Right, so okay. it's just selfish motives anyway. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Yeah. I mean, but, to be fair, that is true though, Steve, because like when you had too many vices and you know, you're know you on your, your way- And all, nobody helped me. All, nobody could. You wouldn't listen to anyone. You wouldn't listen Me to anyone. Me and Kim tried dude. to help you. We Fuck. tried every possible way. Do you we tried know how many anger. times we tried, we tried to help love. You, we tried acceptance. Times, we tried support. Times. You probably we don't tried, even realize it, dude. We tried threats. Seriously, we tried every possible thing. Even, even just trying to like, because you know that there's a boundary for how hard you can you can try to like. Did you guys try, try to help, help me? someone? You know, did you guys you, actually you just, try to help me? A yeah, million are you kidding times, me, bro? So many fucking for the times. past two years, a million times, dude. How? <laughs> how? How did you'll never of you know, tr- dude? You'll never know until you'll you never help know. someone, and you realize, oh, they will yep. never know until they help someone. How much, like, dude? Even like, not just us, like anybody in your life probably tried well, to help you, you guys. A bunch of thank times, you both, you, know? you guys. Of course, dude. I guess yeah. It's tough to see at the time. It, yeah, yeah, I'm sure it is. You don't have that perspective at all. So how do you make someone it. see? You can't. You they can't. have to hit rock bottom. They have to, they li- they have like, to realize exactly. it on their own, dude. They Something like that. They have to realize it and... on their own entirely. And then once they're in a better place and they're looking back and reflecting on where they were, and then they'll notice all the things uh-huh. of the people that were trying to uh-huh. help them and all the shit like yeah, that. Yeah, I think it's still important to have tried to help, even though it might not work then. It's a matter of when they're able to see clearly if that yeah. like helps them realize in their moment where they are able to realize that it's a different kind of better. worry though it's a different kind of worry with hoodie though i'm not no, worried yeah, about his, totally. his emotional <laughs> i'm not worried about state. actually i'm worried hoodie. about he's not as nimble as he used to be dude right, we, there, right. I mean, there's a basketball stuck on the roof the other day poor guy wants to help me so bad at getting it down sets up one of our you know podcast black chairs outside Wobble, 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 wobble falls wobble, back wobble. immediately. Falls, falls yep. back onto his elbow. And and he fell, he fell, he fell down, and, and then you were like, "Somebody come get her!" Yep, yep. She's dancing uh, yep, like yep. a stripper, like a stripper. Yep. It's uh, I think he thinks that he's just as nimble as before he started playing poker, and that's what's scary is that he's not going to be able to do the same move set that he had before. <laughs> no, he's not. He's uh, his move set. You know, he's purely. Um, I think Steve, you said this before. He's purely on a inhaling someone and uh, usurping their power basis. Oh, that's right. He's a bit like Kirby. Yes, he's a bit like 
Kirby, yes. Yeah, and I we mean, don't think he's the, actually the original Hoodie Allen. Right. We think someone... <laughs> we, no somebody he inhaled Holy Hoodie Allen and became him. Holy Hoodie Allen. <laughs> Holy and hold the holy Adam. It's fucking hoodie. Dude, the best part is he's right outside my door, just like ear up against my door. Like, are they tagging them? Just jerking packing? off onto the door. Yeah, he's he's like, like, mm, dun, dun. Literally tickling himself. Dun, like, oh, I'm gonna fucking gunk on your door. Gunk. Oh. You're fucking gunk on your door, dude. Okay, yeah, big bush, dude. That's great. No, but he he just needs to chew better. Poor guy. Yeah, I mean, I can relate, man. Something that's happened to me chewing wise recently is my upper left wisdom tooth um, it must be on enough of an angle that there's a huge point to it. I can hear it. Very white teeth. Hey, how about that? Thank you. I brush so much. Um, and now that tooth is um, jabbing and poking every time I close my teeth, my bottom gums, and it's hurting and hurting and hurting and hurting. Mm, and uh, it's bad. extremely that's painful. Bad. Do you have dental insurance? Should get I that do. Out. You do? It's just it's been quarantined. I don't know when or where I can. No, you can go to the dentist now. Oh, are Make you able on. to? Are you able to be part of Sammy Joe's? Uh, yeah, I just have to pay like monthly for it. How do I get in on that? Yo, you can probably get in on that. Sammy Joe, probably I'm just dad. marry them. She said, if you Sammy pay, Joe, one more pay, time. She said, if you pay double what it's cost, what I cost, what yeah. it costs for sure. Then yeah, slide for me a hundred sure, bucks. Pay, hey, Venmo me a hundred bucks right now. I'll figure it and out. And then and then we'll for set sure, up a how meeting. How much you need? Yeah, well, actually, bucks. hold on, Kib. Steve, I'm I handle their money. If you want to Venmo me two hundred bucks, and then yeah, we'll yeah. set up a talk. We'll for set sure. How much you need? Probably like five hundred bucks. Send me two, two, or three thousand so. dollars. Yeah, for sure. So. Huh? For sure, I can get that to you guys nonstop. Look at this guy, man. Yeah, you got some petty ass molars, dude. Just fucking poke, poke, what poke. What kind man. of toothbrush? What kind of toothpaste are you using to get those teeth? Oh, I use teeth? the red. It's it's truly really a matter of how long you want a very soft brush. Um, a whitening, any honestly whitening toothpaste. I just use like a. I use the, the red crest. I think it's like all red. The box that's just super fucking red. Probably okay. Um, I use yo. that yellow box or the yellow toothpaste. Dude, not it's yellow. yellow. <laughs> Ugh. It fucking. Uh, they they make the baking powder. Everybody smile right baking now. Baking soda. Well, it's gonna look yellow because <laughs> <laughs> mine and Kibs look nice green and bean teeth. Steve over there, man. <laughs> green yeah, bean teeth. <laughs> This doesn't look too good, does it, guys? That's Each of your teeth looks like an edamame, dude. That's not doing like anything it. for me, dog. What if I... Not bad, dog. Yeah. Not bad. I mean, well, you it's... got a lot of the stains from vaping out of your teeth, you know? Yeah. Dude, yeah. for the longest time, Steve, you had just, like, black right here that made your your nice, pretty gap three times as big looking. It was as if you took a like black the Grinch. marker and just went... Awesome, Whoa. guys. Now, what Kib actually said is a kind of a lie, uh, because what? that mark that mark wasn't always there. It was only there said, until when you someone were said, it's there. And it then there I would years, go to the bathroom. Dude. I it was there for... Dude, uh, there, sure, it was there when, when I got... When I didn't brush. There... Yeah. Remember how long that went? Um, a year. No, but it was a year of brushing once a week. Sometimes, dude, it got to a point where we felt bad and didn't even want to say anything. And then it would just be there. Wish you would have. We did so many times. Dude, I would be so embarrassed by that. If someone's like, hey, you no, got that you, fucking you tooth thing like, again. Oh, shit. If you got that tooth thing again, and then I would see it in the mirror, I'd be Aww. like, holy fuck. <laughs> I mean, it was not like an awesome so situation. Sorry, I would dude. just be like, I would be like, Ugh. Like I would just be like, Ugh. Boingo, it doesn't bother me like Boingo, a... should have thought of that. Come on. Boingo. <laughs> hey, it's funny you said that. I've been getting charged for fucking Boingo Wireless for the past year. Before for we no move on reason. To, before we move on to Boingo Wireless. No, I, so that's it's over now. Before we move on to Boingo Wireless. No, I don't we I don't want to move I on to all this no man. I apologize, man. We should have we should have told you if if we did if we didn't want to tell you, we should have told you when it was like that, you know? But well, don't say we. Oh, thank you, man. I'll always tell don't you guys. So look, you I would always tell Steve things. No man, no. Yeah, man. James would always and say it, your breath smells, and I'm like, I'm thinking to myself, James' true. breath smells so bad too. <laughs> <laughs> but then that's fucking, the thing. But I never said it back to him. You gotta tell me. I was me like, then. James, because James can't take it. Yes, I can, and I have. Your breath smells bad too. Not right now, and there's no way for you to know. <laughs> Denial. <laughs> Denial. <laughs> no, I truly have been brushing my teeth and just being trying to be healthier a lot, like healthier just in general lately. Hey boy. But um, for about a week last week. I was eating so many sweets just and so much sugar. Dude. I got a 12 pack of Coca Cola, and that was like the. Whoa, whoa, whoa. We just finished a great walk. Oh, I'm, that talking, one was a run. That I'm one talking was our a... hips and knees were busting, dude. Oh, we were, we were climbing up, climbing down. We did uh, almost 50 flights of stairs, right? Yeah, that would have been it was crazy. It was, which isn't bad. That's dude, as tall we have as the Empire best, State uh, Building, right? Or half of it, maybe? That's yeah. three times as tall no. as the Empire State Building. <laughs> 500 feet? 5 million feet. So it's me and 300 Steve, times the 300, 300. One of my favorite Zack Snyder movies. 
or no? So me and Steve have the best uh, route Steve right now with that we walk. Mm. Nope, me and Steve, because um, no. I'm more important in this situation. Cool. And that's how you base it. Stop biting your lip. Okay. <laughs> we have the best route, and we go through uh, this wealthy kind of neighborhood up in the hills, and we look at all the houses, and we plan on which ones we're gonna we're gonna break. It. <laughs> No, we go by the old Team Crafted house, dude. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. You fucking, yeah. Man, I'm so glad I don't get that reference. Yeah, you should be glad, dude. dude you should be glad. Truly. I am. It's I like am. half traumatic. Yeah, and half like. And the other half the traumatic. King of the world. No, I'm sorry. I was <laughs> saying that it was all traumatic. Yeah, it's well. Traumatic is a yeah, pretty so we have, big exaggeration, though, to be fair. No. But, Are you kidding me? I almost died on a fucking jet ski because some dumbass was drunk. Really? Yeah. Damn. Who was the dumbass? <laughs> was it he who shall not had been named? <laughs> is it he who was never name, named? I'm not gonna no, name I names, just but like, confirm it if it is he who shall not have just been do named. eye contact. Confirm could not have been named. Well, now you guys aren't ever gonna he, get to know because dude, you're just. Well, I, well, I already, already know. Well, I already, already know. <laughs> but James doesn't shall care. Be have. <laughs> but Kib's not gonna get to know because he wants it too bad. Well, I know who it is, dumbass idiot, dude. It was either. PD if Donny you know who it is, then why do you keep asking? It's actually not who Dude, you Dude, there's think only think one person it could have been. It's no. PP Johnny Johnny. There, no, there's no people. one else it could have been. No, there's only one yeah. person it no, could have been. No, think about it, Kip. No. It's the one. It's the Kip, one. think about it. There's only one person it could have been. No, it could have been. Stop two. rubbing your nose, dude. Could... Just, who uh, else could uh, it have uh, been? Uh, who, uh, else uh, could uh, been? who else um, could it have been? Who else could it have been? Oh my God, I didn't either. You're editing, so you can cut it out. You can bleep it. Nah. Dude, one take, I'll baby. You, I'll text you it. I'll text <laughs> one take. <laughs> nah. Let me text you it. So I'm not going to respond James, to your text, dude. Do He's not going to look at his phone. Way, I have his phone. Way, dance, the only James, way you're going to get dance. this out of me is if you say it. If you say the names on the pod uh -oh, and, and edit them out. That's one, the only way. I'm not going to respond to your two, text, dude. Three. And you'll four. never know. Somebody come get her. She's dancing, dancing like, like a stripper. Yeah. Somebody come so this is the one who I think that it could be like a second a choice, Steve. Who I just texted. But I know the other one, who it likely is, who you both made very clear that it's the one guy. So I know who that is. But it also could have been him, is what I'm It's thinking. Keemstar, dude. It could it have been him? <laughs> For sure, man. He was so reckless back in the day and like a fucking... Oh, oh, I didn't really... I never hung out with him or anything. Oh, I did. I lived with him, so that's why. I just thought he was like kind of violent. He seemed like a violent guy. Uh, he was more like, like overcompensating. Like, oh, like a, like a, yeah. No, it seemed Watch like he it. had a... What's up, buddy? No, what? no, dude. That guy for sure had a beat your girlfriend deep violence vibe. No, I saw him and oh, his yeah. girl. They were really sweet together. Dude, no, you're can right. Put it on in front dude, of people, you dumbass man. You don't see. You I only see the good people, in people. I can read people, man. Maybe when he's drunk. You can't, can, dude. If you think that guy's fucking not I violent can read at people, all, man. Dude, nothing has ever happened that you actually could confirm that but he would understand be violent. that he's no. Actually, so you're just, just reading the, him. Dude. Just the way he is. Just the way he is. Not and enough. The way he acts. I Are can you judge kidding him based me? on that Any exact place, same thing with well, a different that would give too much away opinion. My point is, I'm judging him on the same things that you're judging him on. You don't have any extra information. No, no, no. I'm judging him on the, st the nature of his character. <sighs> Fuck, man. I blow my nose. You, you have a happy-go-lucky outlook on everybody, man. Mm-mm. Yeah, you, you have rose-colored no, goggles I, I for I every single person you see. Mm -mm. Or is it glasses? I treat everybody it's nicely. But I, I still goggles, have the... Uh, I can read people and, and see who's shitty and who's not or who's being <laughs> shitty. You know? Dude thinks he can read. No, nah, not like that. You know well, who can't read? <laughs> fucking Aaron from the Rex. Ah. Or spell, I guess. He can. Hey, have you guys ever spelled your own album name wrong? Never Don't in a million years, actually. That could never happen to me. Spell infinitely for me. Infinitely, James, hit it. I n f i i. I can't do when you guys are speaking. I'm gonna be. L e. Sorry, James. I ruined your spelling. Infinitely, infinitely. I might have actually spelled it wrong. No. Wait. I n f i n i t. E L Y. Yeah. Yeah. I was like L E Y. L E Y. Was it L E Y? It's E L Y. Yep. Yeah. yeah. Correct. Nice, so, guys. Would you guys like to hear? Uh, I, I hate to bash on the dude because I barely talked to him, but I also, and I also didn't. You don't hate him to bash on him. You over. bash on everyone at all times on this to podcast. Bash on people, bro. Hate to bash on. Yeah, but Aaron's a sweetheart deep down. Aaron's a sweetheart, not even deep down. <gasps> he removed it. Oh. Nick probably oh told him. Bro, Wait, no, he didn't. My bad, my bad, my bad. It's still here. It's still here. I uh, I freaked out. I was freaking out. The Rex. Um, I how do you think? Uh, or I'll just. Uh, you guys say it. I'll spell it out. I n i f i n t e l y, baby. Infinitely. 
And infinitely. 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 He was trying to say in in Italy. <laughs> in Italy, out now. <laughs> you know who moved to Italy? Fucking what? back in the who? day. Oh, who? Our who? friend. Our friend from SourceFed. Who? Uh, he was a he was a PA. Uh, Joe, not Joe. Oh no, Kenny. Yeah, Kenny. yeah, yeah, yeah. Kenny yeah, lived in Kenny. Uh, Italy for like yeah. six months or like eight months. Yeah. Yeah. Is he cool. still in Italy? Do no, no, still, no, he's do back you talk now. To him at all? Mm-hmm. He is he's back now. Mm-hmm. Yo, we should somehow get him on the pods for some, for something. Sure. What I'm is sure he? What do you Whatever. Kenny Actually, Kenny's probably... Kenny's been going hard. He's been making like sketches and shit, like every week, making little sketches, and they're funny. Wait, I'm is so Kenny proud of also an SP7 fan, and is he also jacked? No, he worked at SourceFed. No, he's not a fan. He was the other PA with me at. Yeah, yeah, he was the other mm. PA at SourceFed. You you would recognize Kenny. You have a terrible memory, but you'd recognize him. Yes, so. yes, I remember him. He was also helped on the woods. He was a pee on the woods, too. Uh, Kip's not going to remember anyone besides John Redlinger, though. What's the woods? <laughs> oh, he doesn't even remember the woods. No. <laughs> so cute, though. That's why we keep him like that. Guys, so I, am, these little moments. I am um, severely aching to create some things. and yeah. uh, But I can't f- like land on what to, what to make. <laughs> Been there, bro. Been there. Been there for uh, ever since SB7 ended. <laughs> Literally. And your knee hurts, too. And yeah. your knee hurts, bro. I think it's but, better from taking a break. But uh, we'll see today. You want to walk today? Uh, I'm going to work on D&D today. Dungeons. Okay. Dragons. Actually, I mean, yeah, if it's at, if it's at four, yeah, like usual. Yeah. Um, are, wait, actually... are, you, you're, are you streaming today, though? Nope. Okay, cool. So we can go up the... We can go I just want to um, as as address want, the Dungeons and Dragons video that we unfortunately said we were going to make and then didn't post. Um, you guys, we're really sorry that we didn't um, post it, but uh, what I do want to say is... We never said when we were going to post it. It was incredible, and we did record it. It was incredible, and we did it record incredible. it. <laughs> no, I'm kidding. It's totally, it's totally he, coming. He hadn't, he and hadn't it's going in the first half. Dude, I know. I fucking got him. Send uh. Somebody come get Send her. <laughs> somebody come get her. She's dancing <laughs> like, like a stripper. And That's a great mashup. So wow, the crossover we never you knew we wanna, needed. You guys want to do some back shots later? No, dude. Oh what? fuck! You guys want to? You guys want a nut? <gasps> dude, you I, guys uh, want a nut on my back and then drink it? Yo, so this is a bit of um. Uh, normally, I don't like to say these <laughs> egotistical things, but I watched a compilation someone posted on the subreddit of only me, which rarely ever happens. Like, because I don't have a lot of moments. <laughs> and uh, <laughs> this. It made me so thoroughly grossed out to see the only parts of the compilation that they'd made were of me talking about cum. Oh. But it's like 10 minutes long. Oh. And it's only like the most disgusting shit I've ever said. And I'm thinking to myself, like, is this what I say that makes people laugh? Because I, because I get, gr- I, I, looking at all the compilation, I was like disgusted by myself. Maybe it's never, just like, all that they have of you. You know, it's like, man, it's, it's all. Maybe that's your have. legacy, dude. Maybe that's your legacy. <laughs> that's Don't you hate it though? Legacy. Don't you hate it when the things that people remember and like the things that stand out to people are like the one-off dumbass things that you said that you're not proud of, but then that becomes like everyone's oh, like, I "Remember this know. joke? Remember this joke?" And you're like, "Yeah, that's the one you that's the joke you liked?" Yeah. <laughs> What about the fucking Academy Award winning song I wrote? Dude, I, I relate to that. Definitely. Like fucking the through the wire bit. Like that's not the funniest bit. But that's not gross. No, not like gross. I just, em- that's I not like embarrassing. Where, where someone thinks like that's such a thing and you're like, okay, James, I didn't remember? say embarrassing. You should be embarrassed. I uh, am embarrassed. Dude. I am honestly embarrassed by it. I really? am super it's embarrassed. Okay. By the yeah. cum hey. talk? Yeah. The thing is because dude, we, we have made so many things over the years together and have said so many fucking things that we don't remember like 90 percent of every bit and joke and conversation we've ever had like in a video or on a podcast whatever no memory of it whatsoever. truly yeah i don't i barely remember any bit dude people post it on the subreddit like clips and stuff where they're like what's your favorite quotes and stuff and i'm like reading and i'm like wow that's so funny i don't remember that even existed right truly truly like when steve said that he was gonna fucking just put a strap on on and fucking choke it oh i don't think this one's gonna be funny though that's what you said what happened what did i say something about steve he said he was gonna put a strap on on and just fucking well, i'm in the chat you could just say that you said that i was gonna i said that i was gonna put a strap yeah, on yeah, on yeah. and just choke it yeah yep choke your chicken string the bean mm-hmm. fillet the o bloom bloom you know what i mean 
That's what you said, dog. Don't act like it's not. Frost your, your flake. Your fucking frost your flake. Thank you. Thank you. You're going to Salisbury your steak? You're going to mac your cheese? Mash oh, your cheese. Oh, oh, you're going to mash, mash your, your cheese? Dude, you're you going to mash, mash your potatoes? Your potatoes. <laughs> <laughs> fucking stop. Stop. Stop it. Stop. <laughs> right, Steve? You, you guys waiting on me to talk? <laughs> yeah, bro, we were talking to you. Oh, shit, dude. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I was saying Move. these things, too. Yep. Move. Mash your cheese. Yep. Oh, that's fucking sweet. <laughs> your potatoes, um, your bro. cheese. No, no. I have never uh, even put a strap on on. Okay. Well, <laughs> well that settles true. that, guys. That's Let's true, debunk. Bro. That myth has been busted. <laughs> yeah, There's hey, uh, you, have a, you have a little dog. I asked James about this before the pod. Um, when you walk Odie, does, is, are there any like areas that he's just, he, like a sidewalk he won't go down? Sometimes, yeah. Yeah, he's like, like he's afraid or something? Not afraid, but like does just thoroughly doesn't want to. And you're like, dude, come on. This is the be- this is my favorite street. But then he'll like for sure want to go down a different one. And they kind of like, Okay, cool. No. So it's not just Yo. a weird thing with little foot. No, no you know what like- it could be also? Um, and this happens with Vinny. So I'll be walking him and we'll be like I'll be like turning the corner to head back to the house and it's he will turn thing. the corner with me because he doesn't want to go home yet. Oh, so Littlefoot's the opposite. <laughs> <laughs> He's always yeah. facing home. Oh, he wants to <laughs> go home a lot too. Yeah, I think. Little, I think yeah, I've but, just dude, been walking a little foot too much. Where is this fucking dog? Yeah, because I mean, he doesn't need that much exercise, dude. He's a tiny little dog. You know, think about it. Like, he doesn't need anywhere the same amount of exercise as uh, Vinny does. Yeah, He's I mean, I was reading about it. He's basically like 30 floating, minutes, like 30 helium, minutes just this far off the ground. <laughs> oh, <laughs> dude, He's Vinny, a little balloon dog. <laughs> I'll so have already sweet. walked Vinny for like 20, 30 minutes, and he'll be like, <sighs> like walking, and I'm like, oh, you're tired, so I'll turn to go home, and then he like stops and like i pull and he's just like i don't want to go home yet <laughs> <laughs> he's still sorry but just like little baby i don't want to go home i love when dogs Finny, don't know you're what they dying want. yeah because he true. like has the idea of like walking and having fun but he's like <sighs> maybe it's not that much fun it's so funner than warren <laughs> <laughs> he doesn't even say mom he calls her by her name <laughs> i know her you know lauren barely <laughs> Man, oh, yo, I had a. To, uh, oh, sorry. <laughs> I had a uh, an instance of being way too high last night. Hmm. What it had was happened? Crazy. Well, see, what had happened was, you know, I've been smoking a lot lately, so I've been pushing it, trying to get my tolerance higher, just trying to smoke more and more. Um, but I did it too much, too fast last night, and I got Ooh. way Look too at him, high. Kid. Baked to shit. He's talking right now. I'm oh, sorry, guys. I got intimidated. <laughs> um. And I just like wait. That's sucked. also a sunny joke. What? What? Nothing. I just I keep fucking. Did you have? Was it as bad as the time that that you had that high accident? High accident before? Was it as bad as that? Because that was like because you you went through like mental trauma, not trauma during that, but it, it was like torment a, is what you were a few weeks ago. Yeah, it was like oh when I had an existential that crisis, bad strain. Yeah. Yeah. No, it was uh, different. It was different than that. This Dude, was, you got to talk about your nightmare. Oh my God. Oh my God. I'm gonna so real quick. Guys. This was a different situation that happened last night. It was just smoking too much weed. So you got, I got too high and I couldn't control my thoughts. But the other time when I had an existential crisis looking at the sky, that was because the strain was back because I smoked it again, like just a normal amount and I still felt negative and shit. So that was the weed's fault. Mm-hmm. But okay, so mm-hmm. check this out. I had an apocalyptic dream the other oh, night. Oh wait, the preamble to this though is that he had, and I knew it was, he was in for a bad night because he'd sent me a text that said, I'm so high, I thought I was a member of Imagine Dragons. Wow. It was extremely funny at the time, That's but I was amazing. worried, obviously, obviously I was worried. I was worried Sorry, because James. Imagine Dragons, come on. Yeah, like I was all worried. The imaginary bands to be. <laughs> I was worried because... Radioactive, radioactive. Um, so this was uh, was this I think Friday night because Friday night I decided it's going to be my one night a week where I order something takeout and splurge and so I ordered some fat salad. Fucking love splurging. And I had a big ass sandwich and a big ass thing of buffalo chicken fries. Ate it all, full as fuck, full yeah. to capacity, <laughs> and and high and extremely high. So I went to bed full, full. Full. So full. Went to bed. Filled, filled right so up. And I had full. and I had an apocalyptic <laughs> dream. Baby. Full. You what? I had an apocalyptic dream. Have you ever had an apocalyptic dream? 
Many old time, baby. Many what James is trying time. to say is he had a he had a, the worst carb nightmare of his life. Oh yeah, sure you could say that. I call it a prophetic vision. Fucking shaking. <laughs> you got a premonition, dude. I had a prophetic dream. He's a prophet. So this now. is what happened. This is what happened. Nice. I'm standing on a beach, and <laughs> it was me and Lauren and Franco and Franco's wife Sammy. And I I don't know. I, Steve, I feel like might have been there. I don't. Probably not. I don't know. Like, I'm not Where the like fuck was character. I, dude? Where the fuck was I? I don't know. I already killed. I your side though. Your side character. Mm. In James's life. So this is what I'm this is mm. what I'm mm. seeing. Mm. So we're standing on a beach and the entire sky is filled with storm clouds. Mm -hmm. But at the same time, it was I could see kind of through it. Mm -hmm. So I saw this like reddish kind of cosmic glow, like uh, stars and shit in the background of the clouds. And then all of a sudden the clouds move and there are five moons. Five moons in the sky. Imagine that. Terrifying. You're so not I'm on like, your home world anymore. Or some shit's going down and Earth is on its way out. So I'm looking up and I'm just like, what the fuck? That's crazy. And I turn to the people I'm with and I'm like, do you guys see that? And it's just like terror in their face looking at it. And they're just like, like dread. And I'm just like, oh my God, what's going on? That's crazy. And I hear this like echoing sound, like some sort of clicking or banging sound. <laughs> And then I look to my right and they're like, it looks like down the coastline kind of there's a city and above the city there's like this giant hole, like almost like the eye of a hurricane opening up above it. And there are these black like shadows flying down over the city. And I hear that song, you know, that song where it's like, dun, 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 dun. that like, yeah, dun, dun, flight, dun, of the, flight of the Valkyries. Dun, 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 is that what that song is? Dun. No. That sounds he was, right. He though. was gonna say "Flight of the Bumblebee." It's "Flight of the Valkyries" is. Dun, 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 yeah. dun, 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 I think so. This wasn't that one, blum, blum. dude. Yours was the one from the fucking Jackass movies. Dun, 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 yeah, dun, when it's like dun, slow motion dun, explosions. Oh, yeah. Dun, yeah, yeah, dun, exactly. So that I hear that playing, but as if it's happening, like coming from the fucking heavens. And, and I, you think to yourself, like, oh, fuck, it's the Jackass soundtrack. <laughs> Johnny and Knoxville! So, uh, sucking on my that. titties like you wouldn't. Wanna be calling me. Odie, Odie close your fucking... Again. Odie, close your eyes while you're fucking sleeping, man. Hey! Odie! All right. <laughs> Jesus. He was a fucking just asleep like this. <laughs> well, it's because he's upside down and his eyelids <laughs> fell just, open. Like, eyes staring at me the whole time. So anyways, that dream ends and I wake up and I'm just like, what the fuck, man? <laughs> And uh, yeah, it was insane. It stick. I have the very clear images of it to this day. And Mark, you were affected man. that entire day. Not the <laughs> entire day. I think the first half. No, because we went on a walk, a, a hike that day. A walk or a hike? A walk. We went on a. We we were we were exercising together, and uh, Rose. And James seemed he seemed a little out of it. Like a, like a, he'd been affected by a bad nightmare. Like yeah, by a was. really bad nightmare, and uh, I could tell that he needed he needed that hand job. Um, and then he so he reached over and I smacked his hand out of the way and I said, "Not now." Did you make him sh shivut? Yeah, I made him shit. <laughs> <laughs> I made him shit instead, dude. <laughs> but yeah, oh, you're gonna shit. Dream. Oh, you're gonna shit. <laughs> Yuck. Gross, man. That's tight. And you that's wonder you, why the, that's all the wow. jokes that people remember from you, Steve. You 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 she wonder why? Jim said that. You said what? the hand job. Yeah, yeah you said the hand job, bro. Yeah, bro. I, okay, sure, sure, sure. I said the hand job. Say I'm Fuck sorry. It. Fuck it. Say kids sorry. To who? To who? Say kids sorry. Sorry, kids. No, You're say welcome, kids kid. sorry. Oh, kids sorry. Thank you. Thank and I, and we can use that clip that I just said uh, for any kind of thing that you get in trouble for. Kids That's sorry. True. That's true. Should we do? A, we should do. A, we should, should do a, do a giveaway. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, just dude, I'm down. What should we give away? Fuck yeah, dude. Oh my god. I, do I oh, dude, yo, I actually have a bunch of shit. I have an old, right here. It's a, I have an old really cassette great. case. Actually, this is really sick. It's I have a, a little bit of hand sanitizer left in here. Um, I also have one of those as well, right here, a little card reader. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I got it. Um, and then I have this Velcro thing. Hey, you guys mind if I take my shoes off? No, boy, don't take them off. Why do you have them on? I was expecting them to be off entirely, man. That's I have desk I'll desk I'll take off the other one now. I'll take off thing. the other one now. You can put your guitars up against your desk without them falling, and it, I don't have enough desk space. So I got and I don't have a guitar. <laughs> I got this cool car. <laughs> um, I also got this. We were going to talk about it last podcast, remember? The Kibbs Bear Sauce Snake. Yes, guitar. explain. All right, so this was... Uh, Sent to our PO box a long, a long time ago, and it says, <laughs> "Kibbs Bear Saw Snake, 20 HP, 
If all 20 from, HP. If all's from Kib's Bear Saw, put Kib's Bear Saw on stage one card. Explosion Pokemon hit. Uh, its size is 0 0.3 inches wide. Um, oh, it only says that. And then it says uh, the weight 12.4 pounds. Its first attack is a fire attack hitting 20 damage, and it's suicide. The second attack <laughs> uh, is a fire and star type, and it's dynamite spike. Uh, 20 times. Flip a coin three times. If heads, this Pokemon commits suicide. If tails, <laughs> inflict 20 damage times the number of tails the coin landed on. <laughs> and then, That's amazing. Geez, its weakness is grass uh, and resistance. <laughs> <laughs> Any type it's, of resistance. Its weakness dude. is resistance. The stronger it gets, the weaker it gets. <laughs> That's so funny. There's some fine print here. Did it's you take it out of the case, dude? Oh, I probably should, huh? No, no. No, it's a collector's item, man. Oh. You idiot. Oh, shh. Um, let's see. Oh, it's, fuck. It's got some lore to it. It said that the only that only one has ever been captured by a trainer, the identity of which is unknown. And then there's just a little picture of uh, James. Wow. See, you should put the headband on. Dude, the headband was dope. Suicide. Man, the headband. That was one of the All funniest right. fucking jokes when you were like telling Sammy Joe like early on when uh, when you met her like in one of the episodes you were like yeah you know I had these snakes and we kept them in the cage. Oh the yeah. The but the opening of the cage was so big that the snakes would crawl out and commit suicide off the edge. <laughs> I laughed so hard at that dude. I, remember I like the. I remember the bit too. about another snake bit. Remember in the desert where kids like it was something about getting if you find if you come oh, across it'll a marry snake me. it'll marry you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And then you said one about like uh something about dynamite. What oh, the dynamite dude, thing? the Kibbs Wilderness video. That was yeah. one of my favorite videos of all time to film. It was just so fun being out in Wait, nature. Because it was and just then, you. No, it was just fun to film and be out in nature, uh, dude. I you had fun doing that one? I thought that was I a period where no that. one was having fun. I was always yeah, was having fun. fun, bro. I was always oh. having fun. Yeah, but I mean like not not like as much. No, I just obviously. love wilderness videos. Like so that was a good one. That was and one the way you edited one. that fucking the snake blowing up. Quick, there's one there. Pans over. I think that was probably Autumn or, or no, Vicky, right? Oh, really? I don't know. Yeah, because... Yeah, you were was, deceased it, for a while. No, it was season <laughs> three. Season, it was season three. See, if it was season three, I wasn't editing anymore. Mm. I think. She killed right? it then, man. I don't know. No, season two, I, I, thought I wasn't you were, editing I thought anymore. I thought you were like... Or no. Wrong. Absolutely wrong in every way. Season, season four, two, you weren't editing anymore. No, no, no. Season two, Autumn and I edited. Season three... Were Autumn and I still editing? And then season four is when we got Vicky. Mm -hmm. But weren't you editing a little bit in the Culver City office? Yeah, Not some really. of the sketches and stuff, yeah. Oh, right, yeah. Sketches. I wasn't doing vlogs. Yep. Which is uh, probably which was probably detrimental to our company's well-being because Perfectly. the whole point. Because the whole point. <laughs> anyway. Hey, it's all learning, see. man. It's all a yeah. learning process. Yeah, yeah, yeah. And yeah. that's what you got to look at it. Look, and we had, we had uh, an amazing opportunity to just hang out and make funny shit as friends. And we learned a lot and we made a lot of mistakes, but that's, there's so much value in that, you know? Oh, and I'm not trying to trash thing. Vicky or Autumn at all. They're no, like the greatest fucking no editors of all way, time. No way, dude. And they also understand comedic timing. It's just, there was a, there's a story that you can get if it's you experiencing the footage and then editing. And, yeah. Uh, yeah. Without me doing that, it just yeah. Sometimes the videos they edited probably were better than anyone else could have ever done. It's just besides me. Know. Yo, besides I remember me. Vicky's first uh, video that she ever edited. It was like we oh, were yes. moving into the Culver City office and we were all so, so like pleasantly surprised. We were like, oh my God, she gets it. Like yeah, it, yeah. she blew us out of the, she A blew us, she blew it. us away. <laughs> Dude, no, it was amazing. I, I, Cause I, I think we were all pretty worried. Um, yeah, just yeah. having a different editor than yeah, either me a different or Autumn. perspective, like a different yeah. s someone who like also didn't know our content. It was coming in kind of blind oh, dude, and she, she got instantly it. got it. Dude, she got and it was it great. And she added such a like a new flair to it for sure. And Samson is such a sweetheart, too. Oh, yeah. Good old Sam Samsonite. Pop, pop. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I knew it started with an S, though. Good. You know. The good old days. Oh, so we do have. Did we say exactly when that uh, Dungeons and Dragons episode's coming out? I don't know. Is that when it's Friday? Coming out, dude. When, Friday? Friday. Friday. Baby. It's going to so be that's dope. In two I just days. have to get the assets. I have to get a couple more assets from Parker because he said there were people that were going to draw some stuff. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Um, in two days, Friday, June nineteenth. Oh, it's going to be so sick. Two days. In two days from when this is going out on Wednesday. Come on, right. Because today Sorry. is Monday. Right. We recorded also, on Monday. Also, next week. Um, we're having Blaine and Chris from Rooster Teeth on. 
Hell yeah. Yes, Hopefully they haven't seen yes. any previous podcasts. Please do not tweet at them or showing them what I said about them being old and not like able to well, get the Well, we same have jokes. to. We've got to give them some Well, they're going to know that. No, because if they don't have any context about okay. that, then they're not going to, it's not going to matter. Like, sure. I want to, no, we oh, want to show them. Hey, Kev, thank so you guys. Next week, Truly, thank I got to show them. I got it, Sean. No, I got it, Sean. On, shut up. Hey, Sean. Sean, will, Sean, uh, shut up. Shut up, Sean. Um, so, Kev, at the beginning of next week, we'll just say that right off the bat. Say, so what are we saying? Excuse me. <laughs> um, what were you saying? <laughs> you got a little itch? Uh, yeah, a little bit. <laughs> All right. I'm, we are. Fuck, okay. man. I just yeah. miss okay, I miss dude. being able to like do dumbass shit with you guys and not over podcast. Yeah, me too. I feel that. <laughs> <laughs> I do miss being able to bet. Oh, 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 oh. Is that your big toe, dude? dude it's his Is that dick. Dick. your big toe? <laughs> dude. Oh my god. Let me try that. Sorry. Uh, I'm trying to get the Eat it. <laughs> Good Yuck, job. Dude. Yuck, dude. Oh, he bent it fucking off, man. That wasn't interesting at all for any of the audio listeners. No, out there. no, I was no. Moving I my thumb that as well. He was yeah, no. Thumb. I was well, moving my the, thumb. The audio, sorry for that, the silence. You guys would have loved okay. it. Some of the laughter it's you just okay. uh, experienced was us bending our thumbs in such an incredibly impossible position and sucking it, on it, them. Yeah, it, some would call it a uh, bending somewhat similar to air bending, water bending type of yes. procedure. Thank you, James. Thank Yo, you. Yo, have you been watching uh, Avatar? No, on I'm Netflix. watching The Five Bloods. It's on Netflix. No, I just watched the last uh, King of Staten Island. It was great. Eh. It was great. I'm bored of Pete Davidson, man. I think yeah, he's Pete totally Davidson just... Can suck my fucking ass. I love he's Pete, totally bro. Just him and MGK can himself. suck my fucking dumb ass. I love him. I got you, James. Fuck him. Fuck him. Yeah, I changed my mind. Fuck him. Fuck him. No, kid, yeah. you pop, can't pop, come pop, on our side pop, now, man. You already pop, said exactly what you were. Pop, 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 pop. pop. <laughs> Dude, mayo, mayonnaise. Um, sorry, what was that show? The Olympian, the Olympian. <laughs> no, Avatar: The Last Airbender, dude. Isn't that? Uh, is it new or like a new season or something? No, it's the old Christ, classic man. tale, the classic story. No, cartoon. something. No, well, you, it's on, you brought it's it up on as Netflix. if there was a, a new season or a new movie or something. No, so apparently Netflix I've heard is going to make the last make. Airbender bro, a movie. I'm just kidding. Uh, apparently, Netflix is making a live action show. Oh fucking heck yeah! Of it. Oh, fuck. Remember it. last time they tried to not Netflix, but last time yeah, that was but done? it was M Night Shyamalan. <laughs> Who should never be fully Shamalan. trusted. Shamalan. <laughs> never fully trusted. He should yeah. never be fully trusted. Dude, that's exactly you should, uh, They should keep a close eye on him. Yeah. But uh, sometimes yeah, he does okay. Biggest disappointment uh, for, well, not biggest, but like biggest superhero movie disappointment in the last while, Glass. Hmm. Yeah. I didn't even see it. <laughs> Yeah, Dude, you ever get stuck going to a fucking 3D movie and then you have glasses on and then you have to put glasses over your glasses? Ugh, yep. I never see 3D Every movies, time. dude. Fuck that. Yeah. That's not how movies are supposed to be watched. No, I agree. And that's Fuck stupid. 3D forever. Fuck 3D, 3D, 3D dude. Movies. Unless 3D a movie movies. was made Get to be fuck so out of here, dude. incredibly immersively no. 3D that like fuck you can't watch no. it but any still, other way. But like, even I don't want to ever see a movie that was made normal but also made 3D. I don't ever want it to be in 3D. It no, never needs here's to be the thing. 3D. If a movie is made specifically to be viewed uh, in a 3D way, yeah. that means that there are certain scenes that are made specifically to be made 3D, which means you can't watch it normally, which means it yep. shouldn't exist. Oh, I think that there's, a, I think there's a world where 3D move like are, are so sick and immersive that like you only watch them in 3D. They're not meant to be watched any other well, way. Well, that's the world we live in right now and it shouldn't exist. No, dude, the, there's so many movies that are like 3D's norm, trash, though. normal 3D's trash. and you can also 3D's watch trash. it in 3D. That's what I'm saying. That shouldn't exist. 3D you trash. Can watch it, you can watch 3D trash. 3D trash, baby. 3D trash. All right. That's when they my rap start, name. Yeah. That's actually fucking. my rap name, dude. 3D right, trash. Whoa. And this is a money sign. Oh. Okay. Put your hands up. Uh. Hands up. And then they stay down. Somebody come get her. Okay. <laughs> <laughs> then the money oh. goes up. <laughs> and then they stay down. <laughs> Dude, that's such a good bit. And then it's stay And then it's stay That was so like, that was so from your throat, dude. 
fucking the raspiest shit I've ever heard. That was dope. It was an exhale, too, by the way, just so you guys know. Yeah, was Odie coming over to you? I thought I just saw a dog on the ground. No, he's been on the couch. <laughs> Sweet little boy. Move the <laughs> webcam. I want to see the baby. Babe, I'm going to put the camera on you. Everybody knows it. <laughs> Hi, Odie. Hi, Jimmy Joe. Uh, <laughs> oh, hey guys! Shit. Oh shit! Guitar, yeah, it's a cool guitar. Nice. Everyone's seen the guitar. Okay, what plants. The fuck? Dude, what Kip has an enormous hard? piece of equipment to his right, and I didn't know what it was at first. Wait, what is it? Oh, the, the speaker. It's like a big mixer thing. Yeah. Kemper, yeah. Can you believe that shit? What do you even nice. do with that? That's oh. about leveling. It's about finding the levels of radiation in the house. Right. <laughs> I'm able to distinguish. I'm able to distinguish how much radiation is going into my ping or be none oh, of the days of the week. <laughs> Whatever racist accent you're doing reminded me of the movie uh, <laughs> Defy Bloods uh, because they're in Wasn't Vietnam even an during accent, it, bro. It's and a they have uh, so one thing that's okay. So Defy Bloods is is Spike Lee's new movie. It's on Netflix. It's two hours and thirty minutes. Oh no! One unfortunately, cares. unfortunately, the first five minutes of it shows documentary footage, and it shows a burning child, uh, which is real, and it is the most disturbing thing I've ever seen in a movie. So I would recommend skipping that part of it if you're wow. If you can't, if you don't want to be traumatized for the rest of your life, because it's it's horrifying. Hey man, if you can't take the heat, you know, dude, it, shows, it shows a kid with skin peeling off, dude. Because and they're being shut held the fuck by up. A, shut the fuck up, Steve. All right. Uh, <laughs> So this it's it's truly an incredible movie. It's it's uh, a group of men that going back to Vietnam, but it shows past and the future when they go back is like a vacation, but also to get some gold that they buried. Um, but they're Vietnam vets. So when it transitions to the past, uh, it's because of PTSD, like a PTSD <sighs> moment. Will and and this is also a movie that is that is very important during the Black Lives <laughs> Matter movement. James started paying attention because he's not a piece of shit, I guess. But Kip sorry, was I was to make a trying to find. Out of that. There, wow, was this, guys. there was this little bug really close, and I was yeah, trying to catch dude, it. We were we were watching it. I was trying to catch. Really? This what, bug. Wait, you guys you guys were both trying to catch the same bug? Yeah. Kip, yeah. What, you, what, what did the bug look like, Kip? Uh, it was orange and had no orange. Hey, what's on queer it? coding? Really? <laughs> yeah, really, dude. Wow, what is dude. it? What is it? Fuck you, bro. Dude, you even know what it is now because you've been fuck told you, and it, it's been explained to you. Hey, fuck you for making I hope you didn't forget about it. I hope fuck it's not something you, that bro. you've forgotten because it's in the it's a part of the LGBTQ plus community. Oh, the puppeteer with the strings, huh? You little sicko. Fucking you little fucking dweeb. <laughs> you think I get some pleasure? So you think I get some I derive some fucking sick pleasure yeah, out of showing do. out of showing the world oh, your ignorance, man? Yeah, bro. From just you think making, I, I get off you to create these fucking narratives and just fucking uh, 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 yeah. You think this is this pleases me to know that one of my best friends in the to whole know, world using words it, so in depth doesn't understand words like that, what bro? queer coding is. It's horrible, bro. man. It makes me feel it's devastating. Bro. It's an ignorance I can't describe. It's you. it's palpable though. Though, and that's a titty. You are a fucking sadistic fuck, man. What is queer coding? I don't know what that means. Queer coding. Oh, uh, so they did a lot in Disney movies um, back in the day. I don't know if they still do it now, but I remember uh, they would make dude. the villains uh, have certain um, aspects that would be associated with like a gay person. Uh, so people oh, would just get that. I remember we like, talked yeah. about this before so on a podcast. Yes, yeah. I remember. Yeah, okay. where they make I know yeah, that they give villains kind of. Yep. Mm -hmm. And how do you feel about that, Steve? You said since you brought it up, I think it's a very interesting topic that I wouldn't have even understood was a thing until I, I learned what queer coding was. And now that now I'm looking out for it. So you're not for the cause. How come? What do you, which cause? A lot of them. What do you mean I'm not for the cause? Which cause? A lot of them. Tell me which one you're talking about. Well, a lot of people have been saying, not me, Cause, but I heard it from them. B BLM. Don't help him. Don't help him, James, please. please. BLM. People have been saying that you're not for that. That has nothing to do with queer code. Oof. People have been saying that. Yeah. Oh, Who? who's yeah, been saying that? It is a oof if you're not. So you could clear that up now or forever hold your peas, man. Who's you know? been saying that? First off, who's been saying that? Well, you live with some people who know you more than you know yourself. <laughs> oh, yeah? Yeah. So. You're telling me hoodie mm. Nick? You're telling me you've been talking to Maddie? And she's been saying I'm not for the BLM movement. Maddie's been saying that. Or Nick or, or Hoodie, all of them. Hey, man. Now's your platform. Why don't you, why don't you give me specifics? I, 
Why don't you give me some, who, who Oh me yeah, who, so you can go is. fucking attack someone, dude. You sick fuck. Attack, Come on. Attack, man. You think that of me? <laughs> I've never heard anything. Dude, shall I bring up one of the things that you've done? Shall I? Oh, is here the we bird go. Bird thing again? Is oh, it the fucking oh, bird thing from my oh, childhood that you're gonna? Oh, Steve fucking go decapitated ahead. a bird. Oh, in come his bare on, hands, man. man. I've apologized like the little for girl so from many Hereditary. Times. He went up to it with a pair of scissors and just went. Mm. Then he tried to tape it back on and then Dude, he sold it, it to a, a fucking blind guy. No, but James is right. It was sort of like Hereditary. The bird was hanging its head out the back of the window. Oh, man. And then Steve was driving and he went. Steve actually put the bird in a car, locked the doors, parked the car in a garage, left the car on, and left. <laughs> Dude, I house of cards did. That's so funny. The carbon dioxide. Ooh. Carbon oh. monoxide. Bro. Oh, is, is it monoxide? monoxide there, man? Yeah. What's the difference between carbon di- dioxide carbon and dioxide Carbon dioxide is what we breathe out. Carbon monoxide is poisonous to us and is in like... So I thought carbon, carbon dioxide, dioxide was poisonous they to us. They both are. They both are. But one well, more poisonous. Well, think about it. Monoxide, dioxide. Two They're both monoxides. oxides, dude. One of them stereo. Stereo oxide. Dude, one of them is spread super wide and so stereo. Then what's just oxide? Is that just oxygen? I don't know. It's something uh, mixed I with think it's, oxygen. Isn't it a byproduct so of an oxygen? Oxide, an oxide right. is... Right, right, right. Yeah, that might be right. An, either a byproduct or something Thank else you. that's connected to <laughs> an oxygen molecule. Like carbon Thank monoxide you. and then carbon dioxide. So there's like mm. carbons attached to... Mm, oxygen you. do you guys believe in carbon dating um basically. dude i actually just talked about I've been that trying on to get my into last it. podcast carbon dating yeah Wait, what's carbon dating it's like uh it's sort of like bumble oh steve you should see if you can get on uh, raya that famous person app what's oh, raya? another famous person Is that, that shit that hoodie uses i think yeah i thought that was like a linkedin thing no, it's it's a famous one. Yo, you should like, try out LinkedIn, dude. Dude, for famous people, James, you like, should get on LinkedIn, James. Dude, <laughs> you see so Raya, many girls, dude. Yo, is Raya like the equinox of dating? Then Raya's like the you have to, to be equinox famous gym. enough to be on it. If you're a guy, you have to be famous enough, have enough followers. If you're a girl, you just have to be attractive and have some followers. Wow, so, what from a, what I've seen, what a toxic fucking thing to create. It is literally toxic. Not Holy my shit, opinion. that's literally like it, like. Wow, what a fucking bottom barrel of society thing that you try to like promote. Yo, what if you kid? got some really nice people <laughs> yeah. watching this and they and they met on Raya Raya? Well, I'm sure there's another whatever, like, yeah. man. That's a toxic fucking thing to build. It you ever been, been on awesome. Raya, James? No. So you're speaking yeah, yeah. out of you're just basing, shit. You're basing your opinion on it off of what Kibbs told you. Yeah, sure, I am. <laughs> I mean, that is that is it. You know I don't mean? give a shit, oh. man. No, I believe you. That's what everyone tells that me. Is it? Yeah, yeah there, because there for some go. reason, because for some reason, he's yeah. About it. You okay? All the time because I'm, I'm asking. Oh, him, I asked him the same exact. He's trying to he's snap playing his a song. Neck. Come on, yeah. oh. like, stop it. Oh, yeah. lights out, bitch. <sighs> What's up, buddy? Yo, y'all check I'm out so, LinkedIn. Yeah, do it. I'm so excited to do D and D chapter two. Me too. Yeah. So excited for D&D chapter two. It was so fun. And I don't even think we like got to uh, reminisce as to how fun it was in that episode. Cause we we're just yeah, in it. Parker it had a over. vamoose right away. Yeah. But that was kind of dope. Cause we were like, not cause really then we didn't have to talk to, to him, done. <laughs> but it was so good, man. And it's like, yeah. I hope you guys like it because if it's like worth it for us to keep going, it'd be so sick. Cause it was so fun. I want to do 10 episodes now. In reality though, we're we'll probably, probably not even going to put one out. Yeah. Sure. You guys, I'll be right back. I have to pee. Oh, have you been holding it in this whole time? Yeah. I told you go potty before the pod, dude. Oh, I did. James, dude, we're going to end it while you're gone. Sorry, bro. So now this James has been, uh, what podcast is it? Beyond the Pine? Something like that. You got anything left? I'm not going to talk until he gets back. Why I, not? I, feel, dude, I, feel, I just feel wrong not, you know, not oh, having man. a part of the. But if it's just I mean, the two of us. Just the two, two of, of us. us. Never even just if you can. Never even if you can't, then maybe you Dude, can. Dude, we can tell a story about how we played ba- basketball the other day. Yeah, so we played some yeah. b-ball and uh, we both got coronavirus. Dude, it was tight. Hey, they actually also removed a lot of the restrictions as far as like going out. A lot of yeah, stuff which opened is up. very dumb. Oh, so dumb. Very dumb. Did you see how many the spikes of fucking coronavirus cases? Oh yeah, cases it's gonna get bad. Like we have to, dude. Florida we have to. Here it's gonna. Like, we have to even do more than we did last time. Pretty soon, yeah. it's gonna be real bad. So I don't understand how people are so fucking stupid. I get, you know, that some people have to go out to the. You can't just like stay in for four months and lose all your money. Um, so I do understand going back to work because you have to. 
But if you're just going out to anything that's like a group setting, mm-hmm. fuck off, fuck right off. You're a piece yeah. of shit. You're actually a piece of shit. You're right. actually a full on piece of shit. Actually, full a piece on of shit. like you're if you're watching this and you've gone out just to like a party or something, you're actually a piece of shit and you yeah. suck as a human and you deserve everything that I'm saying right now. Fuck you. Whoa. Fuck you. Fuck, fuck you. you. Fuck, you. Uh, fuck hey, you. Fuck you, not. Fuck fucking you, prick. Man. Fucking prawn. That's what you are. You're fucking, you fucking prawn. <laughs> yeah. Anyone that's going out right now to a public <laughs> setting is a fucking, fucking prawn, mate. Anyone that's that's going prawn. to a fucking party or like a bar or something, you're a fucking prawn, mate. You, fucking you gotta prawn. stay inside, dude. During We're talking about dumbasses. We're talking yeah, about dumbasses dude. who We're are getting wearing angry, masks man. and are yeah, going bro. out and doing things. Hey, you guys, it's okay if you guys are the ones that and die. And we'll see you guys next week. Yeah, James is angry too. <laughs> get him, James. Say something. Go get him, James. Somebody come get her. She's dancing like a like stripper. stripper. Yeah. Somebody come tip her. She's dancing like a... Uh. Wait, let's do the Smash Mouth version of it. A one, two. Wait, how's it go? Uh, somebody, somebody come, come get, her. get her. She's dancing like a stripper. stripper. Somebody come and get her. She's dancing like a stripper. It's really hard to do over Discord. Dude, we all yeah, start yeah. slowing down, but since there's a delay, so, we're so, all this, slowing down forever. Somebody, somebody come and get her. Get her. Dear, she's dancing. And that's a podcast. Hey. Wait, let's keep going. Okay. Two, three, four. Thank you, Katie Casey, Katie Casey, my stats channel. Oh, 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 oh